Hey y'all, it's the African witch bitch, hoodoo practitioner. I was sitting up here minding my own business. And the spirit told me there are some parents that need to hear this message. <clears throat> some of y'all got some teenagers that's in college and they out there shaking their ass. You might be watching this video with your college age kid who spend more time shaking their ass than they do in their studies. You might even be watching this video with a teenager who ain't even in college and they not even there yet and they thinking about shaking their ass and can't wait to get to college so they can shake their ass. Auntie, no. Let me tell you something, because you're lying. You sitting up there next to your mama laughing, giggling, and lying, talking about, I ain't shaking my ass, mama. Yes, you are males and females alike. I'm a sociology major. That's where I got my degree in. And when I was in college, I was studying sociology during the day, and I was shaking my ass at night, socializing by shaking my ass. It is what college kids do. There is a balance to everything. First, there's class. Then you shake your ass. First comes schoolwork, then you twerk. You, you, you can do balance, you know? I'm not finna sit up and be like, well, don't ever shake your ass college. Yes, they do. And teenagers who are in high school, they can't wait to get to college so they can do the same damn thing. Hell, they shaking their ass in high school. So if you're a parent that's having an issue with your teenager and you want them to focus on their studies, this is what you need to do. It's about to be the holiday season. A lot of y'all kids is gonna come home for break. Get you a mojo bag, put you some commanding herbs and some crystals in that bag and stuff this in your child's suitcase or backpack or purse or pocket or whatever, glove compartment of their car, whatever. And so that that could bring um, your kid to be grounded and focused. Now, which crystal? I know what you guys are thinking, which bitch, which crystal? Well, it all depends on what issue your kid might have. Some kids may have an issue with grounding and they just can't keep their foot still to do their damn schoolwork because they're flighty and they're easily pulled this, that, and a third direction. Then you get you, a, go on my website. You don't even have to buy from me or you can do your own re research and look up the crystals and see which one fits your kid, which ones fit your child. It don't even have to be one crystal. Hell, it could be a combination of three or four or two or whatever. And it don't even have to be a mojo bag. It could be a, a cage necklace where they can just wear it on them. Male, female, whatever. And have that kid spend some time with that crystal so that they can do better in their studies. And I know how these kids are. They swear up and down when they're at college, they're 100% focused on school and they not looking at girls and they not looking at the little boys on the campus. And you a damn lie. Auntie is looking you in your face while you sitting up here busting up, giggling in front of your parents watching this. You be shaking your ass. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. You be, you be sitting up here texting, oh boy, when you're supposed to be studying for that damn test. You know you got that one teacher that like to give pop quizzes. And instead of you focusing and being prepared, you on social media looking up shit. I know what's going on. So parents, get you some crystals. Get you some mojo bags and arm your children so that they could be um, not shaking too much of an ass on them college campuses. And high schoolers too. Y'all ain't slick. Auntie talking to y'all too. Y'all think y'all slick, y'all be over there, uh-huh, I see you. I know you do it, because I did it. But yeah, parents, you can be armed with the knowledge to help your child and give them that edge that they need because their brains are still developing. Don't be too hard on them, you know what I mean? They don't know. They think they know every goddamn thing, but they don't. You know, we all get sidetracked. Hell, I get sidetracked at work, you know what I'm saying? So, and we we all do, so help them out. But, but the thing is, is that we're older now, we have more self-discipline so that we can correct ourselves quicker than teenagers. They're easily, you know, their minds are over here and over there and up there. You got a test due on Monday. You got a C in the class. And Friday, it's a frat party. You're supposed to be studying. Yeah, I'm talking to you, little girl. Mm-hmm. Little boy, why you sitting up here trying to stomp with your frat? Yeah, no. Keep your ass at home and study. You can stomp another day. You got a straight A in the class. You all caught up. Go stomp your little heart out. Mm-hmm. So I'll talk to you guys soon. I am the African witch bitch. Ashe.
and stop shaking that damn ass so hard. I know what's going on. I'm wise. I can see it because I did it. 